So, what's up? What's up? This is a beautiful morning that after rain is Rain fell. So, what are you expecting? Mm -hmm. So, today we're going to talk about the specs of relationship. Now, as we are going into this conversation, no days and no peace. I know nothing. Absolutely nothing. But if my advice works for you, good. If it does not, and you guys have an issue with breaking up, mm. it's not my problem. So, relationship, as I say, is a 50-50 chance of breaking up. Now, I don't even know why I just said that, but let's just keep on saying something. So, as we're saying, once you're in a relationship, you have to do certain things and make certain decisions and do so many things and that just because I don't know what I'm even talking about. But anyways, uh -huh. if as a man you want your girlfriend not to, uh, how should I put it, not to mistrust you, See, don't put your phone on password. Just even if you know in your heart, you know that you have done so many atrocities, so many dangerous things. Hmm, you guys, you got a dirty boo. Ah! Una sabi eh? I know people just stay one place. One girl, one girl and the other girl are going to come. They are the same thing. They have the same thing. The up, the down, the F, everything is the same two breaths mm, one down mm -hmm. so just make sure your phone is not on password now if your phone is not on password and a girl like she touched the phone and she's like oh you didn't put password like wow so trustworthy nah you are not trustworthy bro you are a devil in a human clothes because if they are to open your messages like hmm mm hmm oh holy moly it's not even messages because you act cheap. Like, bro, what are you hiding? You are hiding a community, a community of females. <sighs> I can't even talk. So, once you do that, she will not suspect you. She will be so, oh my God, he's the ultras for the like, ah, oh, he's the best. Uh -huh. No, no, she carried a snake as a boyfriend. Uh, yeah, yeah, you were a big snake. So, as for the ladies, if you were gonna do the oh um they ask you what i supposed to get or what am i supposed to expect from a relationship with you and you go like uh yeah you're going that with the direction of oh he's sleeping with me then what did he expect girl if you're coming to a relationship please bring something credible and credential like Give him good advice, know how to be passionate, know how to be good. Your pussy is not gold, girl. Like, get that shit out of your mind. If you're not adding value to his life, you are taking away his value because, girl, you are valueless. You don't even have nothing. At least if you have money, I would have said, oh, okay, no issue with that. But you have nothing. You came into the relationship with nothing. Unless you came with something, I would have said, okay, but you came with nothing. And you are trying to turn somebody's son into an ATM card, and that is not good. Like, if somebody do that to your own brother, you'll be like, oh, I cannot. Then you'll be like, oh, I cannot do that. I cannot. I cannot allow my brother to tell this kind of person. Like, girl, you're doing the same thing to somebody else. So you get that shit out of your mind. Like, yoo -hoo. Yes, I said that. So, as I was saying, now, for the other relationship advice, in fact, let me tell you, all the things I've been saying from the, in fact, if you want to continue, if you want to keep on hearing more, just let's keep on continuing the, the conversation. But as I was saying, everything I just said now, I don't even know what I just said. So, that I can tell you, if you go and use it, and you fall into a wrong trap. I don't know how to help you. You can only help yourself. So, now, one more thing. If you guys cheat, I don't know how you're gonna work that out, but I really don't understand why 
you are going to cheat and you expect me with the, you tell me the, uh, that is meant for you. Bro, that is not meant for me. That is you not having uh, self-respect and also you cannot hold yourself because what the other girl have is what I have. So what are you looking for outside? I really don't know. I don't want to know what to expect from you guys. So if you want to cheat, let me know. So that once you cheat finish, you can stay there. Don't come back. Come back to do what? So after you are done cheating, now why would you even think of cheating when you have somebody? Like I really, that part in relationship is what I still don't understand till date. Like I'm still trying to understand it, but there is no formula for it. You know, like mathematics, I can get formula of X, but there is no but. Why are you even thinking of cheating? Why are you looking for outside? If you want your girl to wear skimpy clothes, you like skimpy clothes, go take the girl shopping and buy for her what you like. If she's not gonna wear it, at least let her wear it at home for you. If you want her to dress like this or do like this, at least speak to her about it. Or in fact, clear your head from all those other nonsense. Because I still don't understand why you have somebody already, you have somebody you're gonna shout, oh my God, I'm so in love, I'm so bad. Then at the end of the day, you go outside and have somebody else outside and sleep with somebody else outside and you come back home and be like she's the love of my life no bro you are a lunatic now if it's the girl that is the one that's cheating they'll be like oh my god i cannot stay with her she's a cheating bitch she's a dick no bro you are a cheating asshole yeah so once that is done it's because you don't have no self uh self self what self pride because why are you going to cheat outside like what are you looking for outside you have somebody already what are you what are you looking for if you cannot handle the one at home at least break up with that person don't give somebody unnecessary heartache bro like what the oh you guys just decide that oh my gosh i'm just going to uh cause pain for no good reason in the name of just because i love this thing, i'm going to accept all the pain you're giving to me bro just once and i'm out like out gun i'm a gunner mm. so mm, i don't know what else to say so if those advice that i'm giving to you is going to work out for you then fine and good if not i don't know what i just said i don't know what i've been saying i just know what is coming out from my mouth yeah right at the end of the day remember this i am not in a relationship so whatever advice i give you that is your problem if you're gonna use it or not but if you end up being single it's not bad you can i can welcome you to the single club this is a nice place you know that Oh, that is, that concludes the end of my relationship motivational speech advice. Or should I say what? Because I know nothing about what I just said now. And this is morning. And my hand is paining me from holding this for so long. Like, <sighs> So remember to like, subscribe, and uh, comment. Don't worry, I'm coming with the next quote.